It, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my favorite one. Is is uh is the northern ones? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure, Joe. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> We're still in the game, right? You're being controlled by one of your co-stars uh -huh. from any of the films that you've ever been in. Uh -huh. Who would you want to be controlled by? Huh. Hey Paige. Hi Joe, how are you? Doing great, how are you doing? I'm great, thank you. Um, first of all, I want to congratulate you on the film. I well, thank you very much. Time. Oh, awesome. Yeah, I watched it for the second time yesterday. And, and it's cool. so good, it's such a feel good film. Um, and obviously we know the film is based around a game called Free City. Mm -hmm. um, and there's there's quite a popular Reddit feed that's kind of dubbed you as a pro gamer. Um, and this is for the kind of way you saved the character of Steve from Stranger Things that they called a pro gamer move. Um, so what we wanted to know is in reality, do you find yourself being a pro gamer? Like what kind of games do you like to play if you do play any? I played a lot of classic games. I played like, uh like Pokemon, like Red and Blue was my first game, but um, I wasn't allowed to have video games until I was maybe, I like got, I bought an N64 for myself, saved up. And uh, so I played a lot of N64, played a little GameCube, you know, here and there, casually. Um, maybe not as much now, but but I, you know, I put in my time, yeah. Nice, Would, did you ever play like as a family? Was there any competitiveness going on? Um, with my siblings, definitely with my siblings and with friends, you know, playing with friends and staying up too late and yeah, playing yeah. Super Smash Brothers. <laughs> so if you were in Free City mm -hmm. and you could pick an avatar or skin as you like, um, who would you choose to be? Easy. I'd be this guy. This guy. You'd be nostalgic. I'd be this guy. I loved, the, I loved the hands up oh, guy. This guy. Oh, yeah. I love it. Love him. Yeah. Hands down. He was brilliant. I th like if, if you could pick like a celebrity, who would you pick? Probably probably Jim Carrey in the mask. Nice. That would be an unusual one walking around Free City. I think it would be fun. It would definitely be fun. Um so we're still in the game, right? You're being controlled by one of your co-stars uh -huh. from any of the films that you've ever been in. Uh -huh. Who would you want to be controlled by? Huh. I would say, I think, I think David Arquette, he, he would be nice to me. Nice. Yeah. What do, you, what do you think he'd make you do? Probably wrestle. He's a big wrestler. He'd probably just have me like running around wrestling and something funny. I don't know. You could wrestle the strong version of Ryan Reynolds. <laughs> yes. Uh-oh. I would not last long. <laughs> so um, in the film, your love interest is Millie, who is played by obviously the amazing Jodie Comer, who just so happens to be incredible accents. And we do see a little bit of her skills in the film. Mm -hmm. Um, we're wondering if she taught you any accents while you were on set. You know, she did not, we didn't, you know, we didn't really talk about that. I do love her accent. Um, uh, and I've got a couple of friends from, um, the UK and every, you know, they all have different, you know, obviously regional accents, but hers is really, it's really quite nice. Is it, you know, a little bit of a lilt, uh. Yeah, but it's it's hard. I mean, that's not an easy thing to do, and she does such a great job um, with all that stuff. So, and it's just like you already have to, you know, do all this other stuff. You have to, you know, all this action and all this you have to memorize all this stuff, and you know, make sure you're doing a good job. And then on top of that, you're doing all this accent. I mean, yeah, it's no it's no easy feat. Can you do a British accent? Uh, I don't know. Not really. No. <laughs> I love that. That's quite northern, actually. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my favorite one. Is is uh, is the northern ones? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure, Joe. <laughs> I like that. 
Oh, your, your next character has to be a northern British yeah, bloke. Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> that would be hilarious. Yeah. Um, so I heard that Ryan Reynolds was quite starstruck to meet you. You were quite starstruck to meet him as well. Um, what was it like working with him? I can't imagine he was very starstruck to meet me. I uh, The first day that okay. I met him, we were I was in that cop get up. I think, and, and uh, me and Utkarsh were chasing him around. So, yeah, I mean, it was pretty crazy, to be honest with you, because you, that's the odd part about this business is that you end up meeting a lot of your heroes, people that you've watched and admired their work. So, um, the, the best part is, though, when they're just like really great people. And Ryan is, you know, he just wants to make everybody feel comfortable, everybody feel safe, so they can do their best work on set. And, uh, yeah, he's just a, he was a really great leader and kind of um, a role model. Great to watch him work on set. Was there any kind of like funny moments that happened? I can imagine working with Ryan, there must have been some moments where you kind countless. of- Countless, I mean, countless of, you know, he's so funny and he, he prepares in such a way where he's got like, you know, like seven, eight, nine, ten different versions of the same line. So he'll just kind of rattle them off. And um, yeah, I mean, it's, He's, he's successful for a reason um, because he's one of the hardest working guys in the business, I think. Yeah. So your character in the film is is qu quite a stereotypical nerd. I'm just mm -hmm. gonna put it out there. Um, what I was, and you play it so, so convincingly. I was wondering if in high school, like were you part of like the popular group or were you part of like the kind of more nerdy group? Um. I went to like a different school than everybody in my high school, um, like a smaller, like smaller school and then kind of was integrated with the students um, in ninth grade. So I was, you know, definitely not in the cool group. I kind of was, um, did theater. I was a theater kid. Um, so maybe a little bit of a nerd, definitely a nerd at heart. Did the theater kind of get, is that what like led you into acting? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, getting involved um, at that age was pretty pretty key for me. I just enjoyed the uh, camaraderie of working on like a play together and enjoyed the various elements that go into making something like that. Um, so yeah, that was the beginning of it. Fabulous. Yeah. I think that's actually our time up. That went really, really quickly. Yeah, <laughs> but thank yeah. you so much. The film's hey. amazing. You're absolutely incredible. Um, and I'm looking forward to seeing what you're in next. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thanks for all the great questions. Hey, what's going on? I'm Kevin Hart. Hi, my name's Eric Stone Street. Hi, I'm Margo. I'm Journey. I'm James McAvoy. I'm Daniel Radcliffe. I'm Rebel Wilson. I'm Jeremy Clarkson. I'm going to be translating some Scottish tweets for It's Gone Viral. On It's Gone Viral. Ooh. On It's Gone Viral.